Welcome back to Let's Play Red Dead Redemption. My name is Belger, and with me today I've got Commissar and Quantum Mechanic. Howdy. How's it going? Hello, I think we introduced ourselves in the wrong order there, but that's okay. Oh, uh, whatever. No one. Who cares? I was in the last one. I love this establishment. Limited thinking. Have you not seen the future? Everybody, everybody's quite a fanatic. Yeah. Everyone in this game is is quite great, to be honest. I'm expecting to see like a, a leather couch in the other corner, black leather. <laughs> a devotee of the cinematic arts. Uh, sadly, I don't think this guy is a psychologist, a psychiatrist. I was actually thinking the house from Bang Brothers, but. Uh, the couch, <laughs> brother. I don't know what that is. So. Uh, don't Google it. I'll produce. <laughs> Uh, I do like how basically every single person has a hat. It's a nice change. Yeah, well, uh, they, everyone wore hats in the 1910s, apparently. They actually yeah. went outside. Yeah. Now, the, the burning question, have you found a fedora yet? In the game? Yes. Apparently, the owner I, I is a don't think fedoras were invented. Thank God. <laughs> in there. A more beautiful time. <laughs> a more a more civilized time. You could do me the favor to rest. There were no such things as men's rights advocates because there was no such thing as women's rights. Good times. Oh, bit of a shadow over you there. Here in the arts awaits. I'll see what I can do. I'm not much for high stakes gambles, and movies seem like. Well, I'm just a simple kind of guy. No, sir. I don't much go in for your stories. <laughs> You lead Listen, a you run into a chap named Spatchcock. Tell him to get Spatchcock. 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 <laughs> Who? Spatchcock. <laughs> Where? Spatchcock. <laughs> Spatchcock. Spatchcock. Then the fool began to believe. He should have been the hero of this game. Now yeah. At the very least, like rather than playing Jack. Heard he's in Benedict Point. John oh, dies and he plays Spatchcock <laughs> afterwards. That's way better. Fuck yeah. Well, if I see him, I'll tell him. A producer credit awaits, sir. And so I'm just going to lie back on the bed and peer. Pose. <laughs> Career in the arts awaits you, Jack. <laughs> oh. Nice uh, quick change through the thieves' landing. Yeah, you know. It's a nice teleportation dis on display from Jack. Yeah, I'd, I'd rather not put in 40 odd minutes or so of writing in the video. Oh, come on, where's, where's the verisimilitude? The immersion. The problem with um, Thieves Landing is that if you annoy them, every time you come through there, the guys out the front of that tavern will start shooting you. Oh, nice. Yeah, unfortunately, so I, just, I, I, just... Yeah, I had to cut one of those out from this exact film uh, episode. Yeah, I ended up just completely avoiding it for the rest of the game, because every time I went through, I'd get into a shootout. Yeah, it's pretty annoying. But yeah, we get to play Liar's Dice, uh, which is pretty fun, I suppose, if you like playing video games against NPCs. Sorry, not video games. <laughs> Gamble, gambling. I was going to say, that that's not what this is at all. <laughs> We're going to play Pazark to advance the plot. How about a few games of Pong? <laughs> it's, an, it's an interesting game, at least. It's, it's not just the usual... Blackjack and some poorly coded poker. There's a couple of different mini games. Yeah, it's Whoa. just it's just poorly coded liars dice. <laughs> yeah, exactly. <laughs> it's it's really easy to um trick the AI into just losing every time. Yeah, I like I liked having the uh, poker suit that makes you win. Come on, that has to be a bluff. Did did he just try to bluff having two fours on one die? Yes. <laughs> That's... Uh, uh, How did I lose? He must have a hell of a poker face, so I'll give him that. <laughs> yeah, sometimes it's really easy. Uh-huh. I heard Mr. Wilkins got a damn tiger up in his barn. A tiger? Hell off. Is that what you heard? Oh, was that Spatchcock? Uh, no, no, Spatchcock comes up next. Uh, well, good. we wouldn't want to miss Spatchcock. Miss no, Spatchcock is very entertaining. I do like the cuts. The cuts are good. Howdy, Howdy. You called Spatchcock. Spatchcock. <laughs> well, who's <asking>? The fan. <laughs> I am also Spatchcock. Just a guy who likes giggling. You stay cool. 
Or I'll cool you down by putting a hole in you? To be fair, if you were named Spatchcock, you'd probably be a bit combative as well. <laughs> Don't make me come over there and teach you a lesson. Man, I hope you shoot better than you act tough. But that fool really will lose some money. Now get up oh, Jack's the worst. <laughs> Yeah, I don't think his tough guy act is any better than Spatchcock's, let's be fair here. Oh, you're a tough guy. I sure hope you fight better than you talk. <laughs> oh, it's way better than mine. That's why I love playing through these as Jack. I like the twitching back and forth is sort of... The sway, the sway of the hips, you know. Don't kill me! Please! I'm just an actor! <laughs> Go back to work what? then. Other than as he drops his, you know, real loaded gun, I'm just an actor! <laughs> I'm just an actor. <laughs> I was fully prepared to murder you, but I'm just I'm just acting. I'm a method actor. <laughs> I really like to get into my characters. <laughs> <laughs> my god, sir. Would you look at you? Oh, that's convenient. That was a little bit worrying. Yeah. It, it is nice. Look at you. Wasn't pre-planned at all. Look at you. <laughs> you look like you've seen trouble, mister. Enough for a hundred men. Well, trouble has a way of finding me. I like a man who looks like he can handle a hundred men. <laughs> Do I ever that trouble with a capital T? That's just... I love how they put in Jack's, you know, tough guy lines. Sorry, John's tough guy lines. Tough and Jack has to go speak them as well. Yeah, exactly. I think there's only one line in all of these videos that are changed because of Jack. And I think it's in this video as well. It's weird to see them treat him like he's John. Yeah. Like he's some, you know, really storied individual when he's just... Like a twenty-year-old guy. <laughs> yeah, my mom felt the same way. I grew up reading books. <laughs> no Read them me. stories. Jimmy, <laughs> sir, at your disposal. But uh, please don't dispose of me just yet. <laughs> so what are you doing down here, Jimmy? Take a seat, Jimmy. <laughs> Why are you still standing, Jimmy? Monthly back east. You know I'm uh, sending them my oh so witty. Oh, so I'm sending them my oh so witty and oh so pertinent missives. <laughs> like you don't even He's know. He's not that camp. I'm after an action I'm gonna find too. You're the man of disservice. Cheap women, you know, guns, that sort of thing. Wanna show me your gun, Jack? Well, have a time of my life, sport. Touching all them guns. <laughs> Funny man. Yeah, funny as in, you know, not a, a, bit, a funny. bit odd. As in queer, back in the old times. Go, be on your way. Another adventure awaits. Another adventure. Sure. Good luck. Be on your way. <laughs> I trust the dice are played in your favor. If for a brief moment there, I was thinking $27. That's what kind of a pay is that? But then I remember this is the Old West. Yeah, it's like a horse start or some off, shit. You get Sixteen dollars and it's fantastic. Who is that? Are you really this is the one that, that changes because of Jack. Hello, hello there. Uh, howdy, Miss. Uh, what are you doing out here? Um, I'm thinking. Have I seen you before? No, I don't think so. Is she meant to be young? I can't tell. Well, then, uh... Yeah, she's like. Look, are you sure you're alright, miss? 19 or something, I think. Holy Jesus. I've got this confused with something else, so safe out She's here, just miss. drug fucked. Oh, how many Jenny. women do you find in the desert? You can call me Jenny. <laughs> well, uh, how many women do I put in the desert? Uh, <laughs> you mean in Wagga Wagga? <laughs> hey. So desert's a bit much. <laughs> That's the whole point. You're trying to move a <laughs> So thick. I don't understand allegory. I don't even know how to spell allegory. I don't have no time for them medi fours. <laughs> I know that. I know it. Look, you want me to take you back to town? You seem kind of unwell. Uh, so far, kind of unwell seems to really describe most of the people he's met so far. I see things purely. Mm. The world is so beautiful. Yeah, it looks fantastic. <laughs> Horse running around in the back there. 
Cactus. 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 Shrub. Cactus. So beautiful. Well, you take care. I'm so drunk. <laughs> oh, she's down again. Taxi. <laughs> well, l luckily I, I brought some medicine with me, so I don't actually have to go anywhere. That's safe. Oh, that's handy. <laughs> Miss Jenny. <coughs> Miss Jenny. Remember me from 15 seconds ago? <laughs> don't look like the Almighty is much inclined to help you. You didn't give much of a chance, Jack. Come on. Here. I got you some medicine that might do you some good. Oh, oh heavens. Oh, praise you, Lord. I knew you'd save me. Well, that's fantastic. Excuse me, ma'am? You see, it was only through his will that you were ordered to save me. Tell me. She chose to be out here. Were there angels in your vision? Miss. Is there double in your vision? Can I take you back into town? <laughs> She's long you past that. Savior. I knew you'd save me. <laughs> Will you come with me? Oh, I'm fine here, mister. I'm in heaven. <laughs> heaven. This is gotten kind of dark. Welcome to Red Dead Redemption. <laughs> like, just out of nowhere, just kind of... Oh, well, I guess we're going to leave this girl to die out in the desert. Speaking of leaving to die out in the desert... Oh, oh good. <laughs> Not, nothing good starts that way. Well, speaking of leaving things to die in the desert... Oh, there. <laughs> <laughs> Sentient bean out here. Name's Sam. Sam Odessa. Anyway, that's the name they gave my grandpappy when he came across New York City. Good, Good to meet you, Odessa. I'm Jack Marston. You a long way from home. Where you come from? Yeah, yeah. Well, it would be if I had a home to come from. Been out here for several weeks or several generations. Christ, how quickly do your kids grow? I made better time, but my horse... Rapid. ...a lame a ways back. I'm trying to get to California. See the ocean. I hear it's wet. From the Black Sea to the Pacific in three generations. Whoa, slow down. I'm gonna make something of myself there. I'm gonna find something. I hear they've got a fine line in earthquakes. <laughs> Maybe you can find one of them. That was remarkably witty for John there. Uh, listen. Jack. Jack, Jack so sorry. Friendly to strangers. I suggest you head back to Benedict. John himself isn't that. He's not stupid. He's just, uh used by every single person and he sounds like an idiot. Kind advice, Mr. Marston. I appreciate it. He's not sociopathic enough for a GTA clone for me. Like, he's too helpful. He's too kind. John is. John, John does not care about killing a lot of people. Sweet. But he's nice about it. <laughs> I'm terribly sorry about this. <laughs> <laughs> I hate to be a barber. Long enough, I think. This is the best mission in the game. <laughs> Hands down. The creepiest mission in the game. <laughs> Partner, I need your help. You and every <laughs> other fool around here. No, they took her. They took my love. They stole Jeff's heart and they, they took her away. Have you played Red Dead? Oh no, is this going to be like a tractor or some shit? <laughs> How, when do you think this is set? I don't know. <laughs> Can you help me, partner? I want to fuck my tractor. <laughs> <laughs> Such a pretty tractor. It's not going to be a woman, though, is it? Oh, it's definitely female. Yeah, <laughs> I was just about to say that. Lovely. <laughs> hey there. Look for Jeb's love. When will we find Jeb's other emotions? <laughs> find Jeb's pride in Amarillo. <laughs> find Jeb's ennui, wherever. <laughs> What is it, mana? Come out! Come out! Ooh. Uh, That's the other map there. Super horse. We'll we'll leave some traveling in, you know, just to see a bit of the excitement. Give it a bit of spice. <laughs> <laughs> oh well, who cares about that guy? <laughs> yeah. Fuck your fuck that guy. Life. Yeah. What you doing here, mister? I've come for you. A mercy mission. Your poor wretch of a man has lost his mind. He's waiting in Rathskeller Fort. Uh, my man? My man's dead. Lawman shot him about a month ago. 
Shot him in the back, coming out of a cat house. Gave himself his medals. Just like I gave myself to that poor bastard. Unless you've been to hell, you ain't seen no man. What? <laughs> I've been to hell. Well, and where is she? <laughs> Who? Jeb's girl. Who's Jeb? Uh, creepy kind of guy I hear. I hear. I hear. I just saw the I fucking hear. guy. <laughs> oh, my, oh, my. <laughs> this is Lucy. This is Jeb's girl. You dumb fool. Took it off him about a week ago. Hmm. So why would you admit to that? Better come with me. <laughs> why does he still want to help the guy? Get her back to her man, huh? You gon' made my day. What a fine romantic you is. <laughs> so he's just gonna give her back. What the? All right, follow me. Nothing can stand between true love, not even <laughs> capitalism. But like presumably, oh, good taste. The woman took the horse Mister, for a reason. Mister, you I assume that she bought oh, it. Right. I guess. Here, or stole it. Daddy. Oh, you're so beautiful. I'm so strong, yet such a lady. I long to hold you. I missed you so huh. much. You got problems, friend. Oh, I ain't got no problems. Not now that she's back with me. Oh, I remember a cold night <laughs> we spent together. Every night's been cold without you, my sweet thing. Oh. I thought I was sick in the head. I told you he was funny, mister. Life out here does that to people. Oh. I should know. My daddy kept goats. I don't think I can stand for this kind of man-horse love. He gives you your reward and it's a Fluttershy yeah. plus. So let's, let's just steal the horse. <laughs> <laughs> Yellow. <laughs> well, that was we will not stand beautiful. for uh, people interfering with love in uh, New Austin. Let's give you a bounty. <laughs> but what if what if the horse expects it from you now? <laughs> oh, you've gotten yourself into a pretty bad relationship there. Yeah, you just like you're in your sleeping roll and you wake up and the horse is just kind of staring at you. Oh, oh wow! Was that the horse? <laughs> Old slow walk with a gun. Yep. It's, it's waiting for it to pick up clearly something. the most tactical way to enter a gunfight. Wouldn't want to go anywhere fast in this place. Jimmy, nobody told me you were a miner. I'm not sport. <laughs> this is the He's first easy time I've ever been underground. I'm not a miner, but I, I do like to go drilling. <laughs> it You're not missing much. I'm beginning to think that this article will be better written on a tropical island in the arms of a beautiful maiden. Yeah, maiden. Interesting mm -hmm. idea. Now, can <laughs> we get out of here? <laughs> yes, please. In the arms of a beautiful twink, uh, maiden. I have learned that. Go on, don't worry about me. My apparent ineptitude is just a comedic did he just say his apparent ineptitude? Yeah, he's a complete like, misrepresentation. That's lovely. Yeah. Stop following me. <laughs> it's the only way out. I'm not too keen on your type, Jack. <laughs> Are you still here for any reason other than my bristling? <laughs> <laughs> he's kind of a jerk. <laughs> <laughs> yes, your your bristling charisma. That's what we're here for. <laughs> well, it does bristle at least. Let's go. Let's go. Wait, that's not the horse you stole. I stole uh, a lot of horses. We in the desert count three. For, I've been gathering some flowers for my wife. She's waiting for me back in the cabin. Well, that's very sweet of you. <laughs> and we've been together. Is that a type? Yeah, it's yeah, a, a, a carriage return. <laughs> Gotta love the QA here, don't you? <laughs> Well, she's, she's getting on now and years. This is this is the first stranger quest I got, and it's the last thing I did in the game. Oh really? What a nice yeah. surprise! It was. It was a really nice surprise. Well, there's there's just something poetic about that, isn't there? If you'd like to help. So nice and wholesome, you know. Get me some flowers. <laughs> it's weird too. Like you'll be running around and you'll see someone, you'll stop and you'll talk to him, and he'll shoot you, and then you shoot him, and next to his body you see flowers, and you go, "Ooh, that's what I wanted." <laughs> it's a sign. <laughs> 